Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to show you the most fascinating topic of our engineering is the complaint mechanics. So here you can see this one channel name Veritasium. Here you can get the maximum overloaded topics of engineering. Okay. So here's a professor telling something to you. Get back to you. Have I ever designed was this thing. What it is is a compliant mechanism. It's a wise gripper basically that is a gripper. So you can put something in there and it'll get actually a really high force. I can put that in there and and it breaks the chalk. What if you put your finger in there and squeeze it? Like, you would I... scream. So this is basically a use of a flexibility in a component to make use of that that, that forces and into com and multiplying it into the around 1 is to 40 ratio. So yeah, it is a very uh, kind of a profitable, as you can say, <laughs> So yeah, so today I'm gonna design this thing and download this picture from the description link below and here we go to the Keta V5. For additional information you can check out this link in the description. This one site you can find the every possible uh, information of this topic here. So yeah, you can get the book also. I'll just upload that link that too in the description so check it out okay so let's get started so going for start shape and sketch tracer on the left corner you can see the product is there and i'm going to just insert a new part design in that you can see the coordinate system is displayed displayed and uh, just going for a uh, front view Selecting a plane, going for command called create an immersive sketch, selecting the file, opening it and here is the coordinate system displayed. I am just going to align it with the sketch or the photo file and now after aligning in the center like consider to be here. Okay and I'm just going to shift the angle gradually upward okay so now going for properties creating a somewhat transparent design so that we can uh, easily draw the things okay so double click on this part design you can see the all the commands are displayed now select this plane sketch it so selecting a line so first of all the basic part is now the primary objective is to draw first the straight lines after that we are going, we are going to modify the this curves and the uh, arc designs okay so just selecting the center point of it drawing a straight line fine again the same thing it's here there is no problem if you get any uh, difficulty you can do it uh, again by repeating the method okay so I'm just for more clearance I'm going to decrease the transparency of the picture fine right and you can see there's a gap between these two parts so it can move downward by applying the force on the this hand or this hand so this portion should be empty here fine from this point to this point a parallel line is made here over here you can see the constraint is displayed again so selecting the line command 
to this point okay so again the same process goes on till the all the straight lines are formed you can see it's a very uh, basic design like uh, you can draw it by your own but yeah i consider this topic is very important so that's why i'm just uh, putting a more focus or applying a more focus in this thing So I'm going for now a three point arc, right? Setting the starting point and the ending point, and done again. The same starting point, ending point, and the it's done. So, first of all, just check the, the alignment because it's uh, tangency should be there and it should be properly connect with each other so make sure of that thing Now just stretching this point to be somewhat closer to it and uh, this point also setting this point this point and done right so basically we can see the it's uh, almost done like this point i can i can directly put on here till this point So filling up the arc here inner structure is also incomplete so I'm just filling it with the line and the remaining now is this one again going for arc three point arc I'm 
being so now it's complete right for checking the close curve of all the design going for sketch analysis you can see it is closed so I'm just going to extrude this with the help of command pad let's take is 20 preview okay and just I'm just hiding this one you can see the success developed without any measurements or anything so also yeah today I'm going to show you one another, another most interesting thing is here to add a material into the body so just select on the product the part going for materials going for PVC as you can see in the video also it is made up of PVC right beautiful and now just rendering it right so this is a preview of the vice gripper as this force is applied from this side or this side this goes down and the resultant force is, uh, is achieved over here fine so this is very basic model i have shown you 